Hey everyone, I'm trying to install Windows 10 on this old Dell Mini 9 uh, or Inspiron 910 and uh, right here I have uh, the Windows 10 on the media um, flash drive and uh, I also upgraded this Dell Mini 9 in the earlier video with 2 gigs of RAM and a new 64 gigabyte SSD so Hopefully that's enough to run Windows 10. So I'm gonna try to boot this up and try to get it to install. All right, I'm gonna hit zero for boot options. Uh, it's gonna have to select the USB storage here. And then we play the waiting game. Actually going to also try to see if I can get the small little mouse to work with it. Make my life a little easier, hopefully, if it allows it. So it's finally kind of booting up that Windows uh, blue logo for Windows 10. So originally this uh, Dell Mini 9 came with uh, Windows XP. Um, the last time I booted this computer up, it was running quite slow. Um, I'm thinking times have changed and had to give it an upgrade to bring its own life again. So it's popping up the Windows setup here. Um, we're gonna have the language to install English. We're gonna leave it there. It's gonna hit next. And then we will install. says setup is starting. Apologize, I should probably have made it more visible for you. Don't know if that helps. Maybe. So thankfully it uh, recognized the mouse I just plugged in. This little mini Logitech one. Perfect for toddlers. So activate Windows. I can do this later. Windows Pro. So definitely this is installing the 32-bit version of Windows. Accept the license. So we're going to check the custom install Windows. Uh, click on the allocate space. Uh, so it says it's 59 gigs free. Hit new. We'll just give it all of it. So we got the new partition created and we will use that for the Windows install. So this part's going to take quite a while so I'll probably end the video here and in the next video I'll probably show how it looks like when it's all done whether or not I failed or not. So stay tuned.